Hi, my name is Tracy Cornelius. I'd like to welcome you to Get Creative with Tracy. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do um, the direct candle, decorating candle technique. Now you can check out one of my other videos which shows you how to do the tissue paper technique and that means that you can add more colours. If you're going to do the direct candle, you will need to use um, an ink pad such as stays on. These ones basically mean that you can stamp onto non-porous surfaces. And for the project that we're going to make, we're going to use the Santa's List stamp set from Stampin' Up. Love this image, it's just beautiful and it's one that really doesn't need a lot to go with it, it's just stunning by itself. So to do this technique, you'll just need to ink up your stamp with the stays on. Um, I'm using the clear because I uh, really like clear sets and this one's on block E. You could do this with wood as well. And then taking your candle, you're going to very carefully line it up and then just roll it over. And there you have it. Now if you weren't particularly happy with the uh, positioning of it, or as you can see I've missed a tiny little bit at the top, now you could say, well I'm not really worried about that. But if you were, I just want to show you how you can redo the image. Taking your stays on cleaner, just dab a little bit onto a cloth and then you can clean your candle. Wipe off the excess and now <laughs> you can start again. So basically you don't really need to worry at all about making a mistake because you can do that as many times as you like. All you then do, re ink up your stamp again. and then try the process again. So just pop your candle on, roll it over. Oh, as you can see, I completely messed that one up, so we'll start again. I've made my candle a little bit slippery, so I'm just wiping off the excess. So just re-ink it. And then taking your candle, roll it over. You want to press firmly but you don't need to press too hard. And now we've got our image done. And then all I've done with this one is I've added some of our washi tape to it um, which just sets it off perfectly and then a little bit of the linen thread and then it goes into one of our boxes which is perfect so you can have brilliant packaging as well pop it on because this one is a little bit wider if you squeeze the edges of the uh, plastic covering and then it will go over without damaging the candle at all and then you've got one perfect little gift for Christmas well thanks very much for watching really hope you like this project do leave me a comment and please check out the remaining video tutorials that you will find on my YouTube channel or you can check out my blog www.getcreativewithtracy.co.uk Thanks very much, take care, bye!